Hey, I got a question for Ricky. Yes. Ricky. Hey, Bryce, how you been? Oh, um, yeah. All right. What? <clears throat> it's about Neil. All right. What has changed this time? Why is it that he's now been ousted from the community? What What uh, was different this time? No, me and Neil had a conversation. I don't. Well, I don't know if I want to explain it in here. Like, what do you? Like, what did Neil tell you? Well, basically, it seems as if Neil has sort of been ousted from the community, and I am not advocating for Neil. I'm asking from the outside looking in because I'm not involved with it. I'm curious why it is that now Neil has been ousted, sort of. Because he sort of has been asked for community. Was it the KK stuff or what? What's the no. Uh, well, that's the KK thing. That's a whole separate situation. Um, I'll answer that. I, I really don't care. Um, he brought my mother again, talking about how she's going to die next month and stuff like that. And that was fine. I was okay with that. Then he brought up Stephanie's daughter, which is three years old, how he's going to rape her and fuck her and, and break her hymen and shit like that. And he said that. And that was not okay. And then the whole KK thing, that's on him. I, I, don't, I don't give a shit about KK. I'm not friends with KK. But was that fucked up to do? Yes. But I'm a, I would never do it at someone's funeral I don't like. Yeah, but like, like, what I'm saying is, I mean... In, yeah, in, so what um, else do you need? No, I, I would never... I mean, I, I would never say the stuff that, you know, was said about uh, Steph's daughter and your mom. But, mm-hmm. I mean, I've, I've heard that stuff said before. <laughs> I mean, no, it was, like the, it was it was an, it was the next level right now, and he did he apologize? Yes, he did. I had a whole apology of, but I just said I just don't want right now. Like people are mad at him right now, and it's not just me; it's a lot of people, and that's okay. It's, and it's, and I, I think that's what yeah. I think that's the answer that I was yeah. So it's, oh, okay. it's really a lot of people are wanting him ousted. Like okay. I, I, met, no, I literally messaged oh, Bryce. I messaged him back a really nice message. I literally wrote back to him like, maybe one day we can come and we can you know come to terms with everything and we can try and work on our our friendship and stuff like that. But as of right now, after Gina, Gina too, she's another bitch. I don't talk to her no more. Like after that, like I just want to get the negativity out of my life right now. That's what I wrote to him, and it was kind of like, and he he understood that and said, okay, good luck. Wait, was it's sad? I cried. Of course I did. I miss I missed him as a friend. Did you? You cried. Oh, yeah, I did. I was. It's on. It's recorded and everything. Yeah, he was emotional. He, mm-hmm. you know. I still miss Neil. They were I, friends and... I couldn't text Neil all day today, and you know, I I was lonely at one point, and I I want to text Neil. I can't do it right now, so I just I do. I don't tell you guys my whole life off this app sometimes, and mm. I, and I miss Neil. I do. See, I mean, it's like with, with me and Neil, I'll, I'll tell you, and he has told me before, Neil has said, don't tell me anything you don't want shared because whenever I get drunk. He told me that too. Whenever, the same thing he told me. You know, yeah. yeah, so he said that to you too. Yeah, he's told me straight up yeah. se- several times. He's like, don't tell me anything because he'll start asking me about something. And then because, you know, we, we would speak, <laughs> you know, on the on the phone sometimes and um, he would start asking me something. He would go, wait, 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 don't tell me. Because like I don't I don't want to know. Um, don't tell me anything that you don't want repeated. Because whenever I get drunk, it's fucking all out. But I mean, like whenever I've hosted other spaces, um, like he's he's come into like if I'm hosting like a FinTwit space or something, um, he, he just won't beam up. Because I mean, he knows that like you can't. I mean, some of the stuff that's said around here. Yeah, I mean, like in my space, I've got things that I don't want to talk about and. And and he's fine with it. Like he's never he's never gone at me, going, you know, oh, you didn't fucking give me a mic. He's never been like that. He just knows. I mean, he and I have got, <clears throat> I guess we've got like boundaries on, on that. But no, anyway, I didn't know that he. So he he said something about your mom. I didn't know that. <clears throat> well, you know what well, I think. He apologized for that though. He, he, he was hurt though. That. I'm not making excuses, but like you know, when he went and said that about you, he's probably like quite like we were hurt. literally we were literally talking around the conversation and ignoring him, like acting like he wasn't there. So we were having a conversation. It was fine. He's like, "Oh, your mom's to be dead. She'd be bleed." Like it, it's the stuff that he says. Just but 
Well, I, he, he was trying to hurt you because he felt hurt by you. But see, so I didn't get hurt by it. Back. And then when he brought up Steph's daughter, she's three years old or two or three or whatever. She's young. She's a baby. Yeah. And yeah. saying how he's going to make her bleed and shit. That's when I got over the edge and I said, I can't take this no more. Like, my mom yeah. is doing well. She's doing fine. But, like, you know, to say something like that, it, make, it looks really bad. And then Mock went, Mock went after him. And then he posted that tweet, as you all saw, right? He posted that tweet. That well, he Mock's to... a fucking fraud. Mock, Mock's a fraud. Well, I've heard the recordings of whenever she... Yeah, I don't give a fuck about Mock. She can beam up right now. <clears throat> anyway, I'm not I'm not even going to go into that because she's not up on the beam, so whatever. But, you know, she she's another fucking fake. But, yeah. Okay. But do I miss him as a friend? I do. John has told me he's going to go kill him. <laughs> no, no, he's not. He's like going crazy. You miss him, but not me? <sighs> God, John, calm down. I'm saying, like, cried over fucking Neil. Oh, my God. You know, uh, I hate, I, you know, I hate people that fucking uh, act like they're big and bad and shit, but they cry to other people about me and they fucking... Uh, Act like they're big and bad, but cry in DMs about people attacking them and shit. Yep. Don't you hate that shit? There's a lot of them on here that do that fucking shit. No more. If you can't handle, (laughs) handle yourself, stay the fuck out. I'm not going to fucking defend anybody. You defend yourself. If you can't defend yourself, keep your mouth shut. That goes for anybody. Keep your fucking mouth shut. Or like no mad more you're... defending. 